Alright, this is going to be a demonstration of the 172 lab that I've been working on. Uh, EEC 172 is an embedded systems class, and so we're given this uh, Texas Instruments chip uh, with a luminary micro processor on board and a bunch of peripherals that you can uh, play around with. And uh, we're given a little infrared receiver, which you can see there, it's that little black dot. And uh, we were also given a remote control, which is uh, this guy here. And uh, the purpose of this lab was to decode signal sent by the remote control that's captured by the uh, IR receiver. And so I'm going to go ahead and show you. Um, so now I'll reset, reset my board here. And you can see when I push uh, one of the track numbers, you can see it pop up on that little screen. And uh, it's hard to see it's really blurry but you can see the gist of it by when I hold down the button it uh, scrolls down and that little status LED on the right of the screen is flashing um, I can also push music skip left and right uh, right here to move the number across the screen right and left and I can also use uh, the memory button that will cause it to leave a trail behind where the number goes so we can do that all over the screen and when I'm tired of having all that stuff on the screen I can hit clear and uh, the clear button will uh, clear the screen and I can use the shuffle button and the shuffle button will push the uh, position of the number in a random place on the screen and uh, if I hit memory, it will no longer leave the trail of which shuffles have been pressed. And uh, that's about it. Oh, and then play will actually, play will return it back to its default position. So, thanks for watching.